Okay, I want you to guess my favorite gaming series. And I'm, I'm actually going to give you a little hint. It's not Pokemon. As much as I play it, it's not the series of gaming that's the closest to my heart. You might just be able to guess from the title of the video and the thumbnail that it is actually Sonic the Hedgehog. Now, some of you may be asking why. It's a little odd. And, you know, a lot of people say, oh, I joke on Sonic all the time. I do. I do. But that doesn't change the fact that I love him. Like, you know, like, I'm, I'm, this isn't the kind of love where it's like, oh, yeah, I love Pokemon. No. I love Sonic the Hedgehog. And not on some furry shit, you know? Not, not, on, not, I'm not in a furry way, but just in a, like, he was my first ever, like, game that I actually played myself. Like, the first console that I ever had, I had handhelds before, but the first console I ever had was the Sega Dreamcast. That was the first console I ever owned in my life. And the first game I got for it, Sonic Adventure 1. Now, this, of course, wasn't the first Sonic game I played. I, I love Sonic from way before the Dreamcast and way before Sonic Adventure 1, because whenever I go to my cousin's house, they would always have the Sonic games, and I just used to fall in love with those games, man. The speed, the, the characters are cool, you know? It was... this Man... I love Sonic the Hedgehog, man. I really do. And I really wanted to get back in touch with the series. I used to do so much Sonic stuff. I am such a Sonic fan to the end, man. I love him more than anything. And if you've been watching my videos for a while now, you know for a fact that this is true because I've been using a lot of his stuff as like slight reference in my videos, you know? So a lot of you guys may know this already, but yeah, I'm Sonic the Hedgehog, man. He's always gonna be the closest to my heart out of any gaming series, any gaming, franchise that ever becomes institutionalized, I'll, I'll love Sonic the Hedgehog to the end of it, you know? That might just be the nostalgia, it might just be me being a fanboy, but it doesn't change that fact. So, what I wanted to do is play through the, 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 the one of the earliest memories of Sonic the Hedgehog that I've ever had with you guys on my channel. We're going to be playing through Sonic Adventure 1, which is, which is a fucking timeless, well, not timeless, but it's, it's a classic. It's an absolute classic. And it's part of the reason why I'm the person who I am today, you know? This, I don't know who I would have been if I hadn't played Sonic Adventure 1 on the Dreamcast in 1998 when I did, you know, 1999, I can't remember exactly when, but it, man, um, this is going to be really something for me. I haven't played this game in so long, you know? So I'm really just kind of, like, really touched up by it, you know? No, no homo, but... Hey man, let's get into this man. I'm really gonna, I'm looking forward to this man. I've really been wanting to do this for a while now. Let's get it started. Oh, and I got everything hooked up to my, um, my PS4 controller. So that's how I'm gonna be playing. I'm gonna be playing on Steam. Because they had this awesome sale, this deal where you can get like all the Sonic games ever made on PC at least. Or get them for PC for like $20. So I caught, I took advantage of that. So we're gonna get into this man. Damn man, Sonic Adventure 1. This game, man, I can't explain to you guys enough the the significance this game has to my life, you know? I, I'm not joking when I say this is this is part of the reason why I'm who I am today, man. This is a big reason why. Here we go. Yeah boy. <laughs> Let's go, Sonic. <laughs> oh man. Select for a start. The controller works perfectly fine. Man, we're gonna make us a new save file. Let's go. Damn, man. This is really something. Man. Select a character. This game, man. I, I can't express to you guys how, Let's get how much of this game changed my life, man. Oh, man. This is just... This is a lot for me, man. Oh, Station Square. Oh, man. This game, man. Damn, the music and everything. I remember this. My childhood is just rushing back to me, man. It's really rushing back to me. Oh, and then Sonic comes through. He's jumping from the roofs. Oh man. Mm, mm, mm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is happening, <laughs> man. Yeah. It's an old game, man. This is old. This is like over almost 20 years ago. But I don't love it any less, man. You are completely surrounded. Surrender yourself. Mm -hmm. Rock on! 
Ready? Fire! Wait a minute, what happened to the bullet sounds? They're supposed to be bullet sounds, like boom, 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 boom. What the hell? Oh no! Our weapons are useless! The gun sounds are in the game for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe it's censorship. Oh boy, here we go, man. Here we go. Some of you guys may not have played through this yet, so I'm not going to spoil anything. We'll just go through this together. And, um, man, this is a classic, though. This is classic. Oh, man, this... I can't believe I'm playing Sonic Adventure 1 on a PC! This is just... Oh, man. This plays just like how it does on the Dream on the Dreamcast. Just, you know, and I didn't have this for the GameCube. No, this, the GameCube wasn't my first console, you know, Sonic Adventure DX. I played this Sonic Adventure 1 on the Dreamcast, man, not on the GameCube. I did get it for GameCube afterwards, you know, just to see what the remake was like, but I originally had this for the Dreamcast, you know? Oh boy, here we go. This fight is so easy. <laughs> I'm just messing around with it though. Come on. Oh wow, I'm getting fucked up. <laughs> okay, come on. Come on, baby. Get down from there already. Here we go. Got him. You gotta use the homing attack. Hey, I'll play with you so much attack. attack. <laughs> yes! There we go. Oh man, this is something. This is. I'm I'm surprised, guys. I'm sorry uh, if I'm coming across weird, man. This is just really wow to me, man. Come on, you big drip. Where you going? That was such a great insult. <laughs> Back then, as a kid, I was like, "This is badass. <laughs> this is amazing." This is a <laughs> as a kid, man. This uh, this whole game had me, and the, the graphics for Sonic Adventure One on the original Dreamcast weren't as good as this. So his hands in the Dreamcast version were like stuck like this. So it's like, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll play with you some other time. <laughs> it's chaos, the god of destruction. And the way he laughs. <laughs> As you guys can see, I know this man. In our playthrough, in our playthrough, you guys are going to see the extent of my knowledge on this game, and not just about stuff that's normal. I know how to hack huh? this game to the core. In most Sonic games, I know how to hack to the core. What? Tails? Not as well as Dark Speeds, though, Watch but out. that's You're another thing. Ah. Tails. Fuck. Now, what am I gonna do with you? So, in this game. Um, oh, she's looking mighty fine. You see them pixels on her? Oh, lord. Let me see, how do I turn the camera? Okay, here we go. Yeah, she's looking good. Mm. Oh man, look at them triangles, dog. <laughs> but um, yeah, in this game, Sonic and his friends live in Station Square, which is like pretty much a city. It sort of reminds you of um, the Sonic X series, but this is way before, you know? Sonic X is built off of this shit. You can actually fall in the water, but I didn't get to do it fast enough. Man, here we go, let's go. Emerald Coast, let's rescue Tails. Oh, I can't believe I'm playing this. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man, I'm sorry, man. This is just sending goosebumps to me, man. Oh, man, I can't believe this. This is amazing. This is amazing. I mean, I knew you could do this for a while now, but... The fact that I'm just able to play through my childhood like this, this is my childhood, guys. Like, this isn't just some regular old Sonic game, you know? I mean, I guess to you guys it may be, but to me, this game is like. Damn, man. This is the first game I ever played on my first console I ever owned, man. Can you guys understand that significance, man? Oh, man, I'm, the controller is really sensitive. Oh, man, I gotta get used to this. Oh boy, speedball, do the ramp, boom. But like I said, I know how to hack this game really, really well. So, throughout this game, I'm gonna be. Oh man, oh, I fucked up! Yeah, that happens sometimes if you don't get enough speed rolling up the ramp. 
But um, yeah, I really there's actually a life box back here. I'm about to get that shit. There we go. But yeah, I know how to hack this game really, really well. So throughout it, I'll probably be showing you guys some of the stuff that I know how to do. Wrong stuff. Here we go. Oh man, I'm losing my touch a bit. This, I gotta really get used to this. Okay. Oh my goodness, I'm fucking up. But yeah, the game's really buggy. <laughs> it's really, really buggy. That's one of the gripes that the game had. But to me, I love it either way, man. I'm, I'm not concerned with it. And you know, I gotta get used to the sensitivity of the sticks, I guess. Here we go. Yeah, I love this part. <laughs> I remember when I was eight years old and I saw that the first time. I was like, oh my god, that guy's amazing! <laughs> I was so blown away by it. Man, you guys don't understand the significance. I gotta really get used to the controls though, god damn. Oh, these little animals, they're made for um, something else. I'll show you guys that later on down the line, but yeah. Most of you probably already know most of the stuff that I'm talking about with this game, though. It's pretty old. A lot of people have played it. Oh, well, no, I really want to get that life bar. Yes. There we go. Alright, let's see. Did you know that if you run across these, you don't have to jump? Just like that, you see? And there's an enemy up there, but you can only get him unless you... Okay, here we go. Let's see if I can still do the wall run. There's a speed bubble up here, so I want to see if I can get that. Come on. Come on! Let me get it! There we go, baby. Let's go. Let's see if I can aim this right. There we go. There we go. Not as smooth as I used to do it, but um, I'll get the hang of it eventually. Come on, let me go. There we go. This game is so buggy. <laughs> now that I, I don't know, maybe I'm noticing the bugs more now that I'm older, you know what I mean? Like, I'm really noticing them now. Okay, come on. Man, oh man, this game is so glitchy. <laughs> but it, <sighs> okay. It will take you to panels two and three. Jump as soon as you land on a panel, or else you'll fall. Come on. Yeah. All right, let's go. I used to love this part. Classic, man. Absolute classic. What, what else can I say, man? Look at that score. Serious. Oh, and in this game, yeah, you collect emblems. And you get one every time you complete a goal or an objective in the game. And I think there's 180 in total. And then you get something special if you get them all. Hey, Sonic! Long time no see, huh? I'm just glad you're okay. I used to love the way he talked. You see his mouth and his teeth like... What happened anyway? You're too good of a pilot to just crash like that. That was a test run using a new prototype propulsion system. It's got a few bugs to iron out. Why not just use my plane, the Tornado? Thanks, but you gotta check out my newest power supply. The newest power supply. A crack rock. Whoa! Whoa. That's a high-priced drug! <laughs> Yep, I just happened to find one of the seven emeralds during one of my test flights. This thing's got unlimited power, you know. Unlimited power. So I figured, why not use it to power my plane? Supercharged! <laughs> come on, come over to my workshop, workshop Sonic. I've, I've got Sonic something I've got to show you. It's in the Mystic Ruin. The fastest way is by train. Let's go! That's just kind of always struck me as odd. Sonic and Tails just, you know, they're catching the B5 over to some ruins and now you unlock Tails in the game so you can play as him from the character select screen and the significance of that it'll make more sense later on i'm the hotel manager call me if you need anything and by the way if you want to get visit the chow garden take the left f elevator chow is so cute yeah chow are another thing that we're going to be exploring as we get into this game it's it's like uh it's like taking care of take pets the train to the mystic ruins so you know this is station square man a lot of people around, have you heard? Somewhere out there, there's a man called Dr. Robotnik. First he captures helpless animals, then he throws them into machines. Oh, the poor animals. Yeah, so, 
as you guys can see, you know, this is just general city, you know, really nice area, really clean, straightforward city. Oh, whoops, sorry. Yeah, you can actually, like, jump on them and they'll, like, cover their heads like this. <laughs> That's cute. La la la, we're in love. I'm gonna fuck tonight. <laughs> There's a special for couples at Twinkle Park. You bring a date, you can get in free. Fair old, old relationship, hello, new relationship. That's what I always say. Damn, as a kid, maybe I didn't realize it. She a thought. <laughs> she a thought. <laughs> oh, man. Right, what's up with this guy? Wait, let's take a look at this guy. Whoops, sorry, man. Damn, I'm trying to talk to him, not run him over. I own this building. Well, I'm not sure about this, but I heard somebody saw a monster. The roads in the city are office. The roads into the city offices are closed right now. Hmm. Oh, by the way, this building has some real crazy significance later on. It doesn't look like it would. Well, actually, yeah, it kind of does look like it would. What's this? What's that called? Cyber. Cyber. Cybernet Inc. Cybernet Inc. Okay. I wonder what that means. You know, I, I'm, I'm, I'm definitely a lot more aware of certain things than when I was a kid, you know? And then we have the newspaper stand here. I'm the news stand saleswoman. I'm always the first one to read the news. Of course you are, because you're the first one that gets it. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this, and want to see more of it, leave me a like down below and let me know in the comments, and um, we'll do more of this series. I'm definitely ready to get into it, so if you guys are ready as well, then we can do this, man. I'll talk to you in the next video. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, Please have yourself a damn good one.